Oh, hi there. It's been a while. Can I just sleep for 10 hours? Maybe 20. Fred Sasakamus, born December 25th, 1933. Fred here was a professional ice hockey player. Born in Debden, Saskatchewan. He was a Cree, of course. That's where all the Crees come from. He grew up on a Takoop reserve. Fred was one of 11 children with six siblings that passed away from smallpox. At the age of six, Fred and his brother were forced into a truck and taken to residential school at Duck Lake. It was here that he would learn to play ice hockey. In 1944, he joined the Duck Lake ice hockey team. It was said that he had an extraordinary left-handed shot. While Fred had become one of the star players of the team, he left the school at the age of 15. This was because he feared going back to that school. So imagine his shock when a scout showed up at his home. And at the age of 16, he would join the Moose Jaw Canucks, part of the Junior Western Hockey League. During the 1953-54 season, he scored 31 goals, and he was the league's most valuable player. During the season, he made his debut with the Chicago Blackhawks. The good old hockey game. He would be sent back to juniors and then called back again. In total, he played 11 games for them that season. The rest of his career was spent in various minor leagues. To say the least, at this time in history, it wasn't a very friendly game for an, an indigenous person to play hockey. He paved the way for others to dream big. After retiring from hockey, he would go on to serve as band counselor at the Ataku Nation. He would serve a total of 35 years, and six of those he was chief. He was also extensively involved in the development of sports programs for Indigenous children. He used his fame to promote youth and sports. And in 2002, he was honored by the Blackhawks at a home game. And in 2007, he was inducted into the Saskatchewan Hall of Fame under the Builders category. He was also acknowledged for his achievements and contributions by the First Nations Assembly and the Federation of Saskatchewan Indian Nations. The founding member of the Indian Hockey League, sadly in 2020, he passed away. What a beautiful legacy.